DVR headed out. Alright, made it to what? Tuscaloosa? Tusca Tuscarora. Look at my uh, who wants, who wants to talk? Six out of eight of us survived the trip, so that's good news. Yeah. Yeah, I'm yeah, pretty satisfied with that ratio. Survival of the fittest. This is Greta. Oh, Gretchen! Gretchen! We keep naming it different names. Gretchen. She like Gretchen. She's a beast, but she's losing weight daily, so... <laughs> yeah, she's walking around a lot. She's gonna lose a lot of pounds. <laughs> yeah. So, somebody tell the camera what we just did. We did 428 rods. We did 428 of that. 5,000 miles. Which equivalates to 5,000 miles, and we get this view. The beauty. Yeah. The view. I guess 5,000 miles. Oh, nice. Pretty neat. Hello. Austin carried this aluminum one all the way. With a pack. With a pack. What do you want to say, Dad? <laughs> Proud of you. Gavin went what? Two times? Three times? Yeah, Gavin did, like, Gavin's like running around this place. <laughs> Zach carried the Kevlar. So, Adam carried the Gretchen. The Greta? Bob? Whatever it's called. And the Kevlar for a bit. And the Kevlar for a bit. So. Nice round. Nice round. Alright, we found a uh, camp for tonight. Beautiful. This is a five star, um, well reviewed five star campsite. This is what we got going on right now. We're tired. We went maybe 10 miles, maybe a little bit more. First day. Somebody's over there. Oh, that's Ellie. Um, yeah, and we've been doing some jumping off this. I'll show you. Oh, you want to jump for the camera? Jump, jump, jump. <laughs> there's Emily, and there's Gavin. <laughs> Anybody have anything to say? I'm going to be sore tomorrow. Ellie said she's going to be sore tomorrow. Whoa! <laughs> For the camera. Good morning. How's everybody feeling? Pretty good. Better than you for new friends. Yeah, yeah you good. had a rough night. Can you tell them about your night? Oh. <laughs> you don't have a sleeping bag for me, so I was. That's why I'm wearing a hoodie and pants. <laughs> so that's okay. We also messed up. Um. I brought a brand new bug net and gave it to Gavin for the first time. And Gavin wasn't able to seal it, so he came into their tent last night. But you slept decent, right, Gavin? After? You slept okay? So, we are excited to do another 15 miles today. Just kidding. <laughs> cool. And what, what lake are we on, Gavin? We're on Gillis. Uh, we, we were out in Tuscarora last night, and we're going to keep moving.
Yeah, everyone's got to fish. Hang on, hang on. I got to record this out. Wait, stop, 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 stop. Let's curl around, Domino. Oh my gosh, Domino. You got fish? Bear Domino's not eating tuna tonight. I don't know, that's his nickname now. He's just a bear. Dude, look at his reel. It's bending. Are you pulling on a rock or a fish? It's a fish. Oh. Here, let's paddle towards him. Paddle on your right. Oh my gosh! Nice Domino! I'm so happy for you! I was telling Emily last portage I'd be like stoked if you got one. First trout I've ever caught. First trout he's ever caught, GoPro. Alright. Thumbs up, Gavin. Yeah, good job. Sales are up. There's Zach. Gavin. Trans boundary waters. Sail. Sail. Except we can't say the first solo one. We were we're going with six sails. <laughs> This is the new improved sail for the video. And we are actually moving. Oh yeah. Turn around, Domino. All right. We're going to make lunch right now. Self-propelled. Self-propelled. Yeah, Zach, you hear the chef on board right now. <laughs> Gavin and I are steers. Ellie, Adam, and Austin are the laborers. All right. <laughs> give me one of the peppers. Yeah. I'll give her a rip. Oh, look at that nice island. How did we get to this island already? What the heck? This has to be seen. We are flying. Woo! Oh, shoot. Dang it. Sorry. <laughs> ah! Okay, I will record. Sorry, yeah, you got it. Yeah, I got a, I got a lot of things going on right now. <laughs> Look at that! Oh my gosh, that sail is going crazy. Woo! Yep. <laughs> Zach is done making food for all of us. Thank you, Zach. Yeah. Well, there's enough for everybody to have a second one. If yeah. The Coast Guard is going to come out and tell us to turn off our motor. <laughs> Alright, just got to the second day's campsite. Everybody's pretty happy about this cliff here. And we think this is where Max and Claire proposed. Or I guess Max proposed to Claire. And she ended up saying yes, so it's got to be a good one. Gavin, Ellie, Austin with his fish. Bobby. We're all pretty excited to eat Bobby tonight. Oh, there's Ellie. Good morning. Day 143 in the wilderness. We're starving. <laughs> Near the brink of death. But we still have a little bit of food. Zach has been scavenging. Found some blueberries yesterday. We only have tuna cream cheese sandwiches left. It's gonna be dire. Strawberry cream cheese sandwiches. Um. Emily and Ellie sacrificed a sleeping bag for me last night. And they slept okay. Probably did some snuggling if I had to guess. Um, Gavin slept in the hammock last night. Pretty epic. Austin, Austin enjoyed sleeping with me and Zach. Yeah. <laughs> That's all you can say about that. <laughs> He's a cuddle bug. Watch out, ladies. Get our score. Already, huh? Three for me. I'm in the lead. And Ellie's doing her first one. We think. Three times. 
I'm, yeah, I'm in the lead the other way. Got our tuna cream cheese sandwich. You saw it here first. Strawberry cream cheese, maple, what is it? Maple something like that. So next time we can make it again. Brown sugar and cinnamon, strawberry. I, great value tuna, plain, garnished with a wild blueberry. We shall, we shall fold this. Oh, also update, Ellie is actually, she actually has a septic problem. She still hasn't gone yet, so we'll keep you up to date on that. Cheers. Yeah, prayers. So Ellie, are you just holding it until we get back? No, I'm trying. Well, Alright, what's the verdict, boys? What do you think, Gavin? Describe what you're experiencing right now. It's it's sweet but salty. <laughs> the cream cheese actually overpowers the tuna quite a bit. I'm just saying, if you like texture, you like this. <laughs> you, this is, this you, is five star. This you, is genius. <laughs> you got a good mixture of spread and moist. There's a cross section for all the fans out there. Not bad. Which was Round Lake, but more specifically, it was Missing Link, which is right around here. And then we took this. 142 rock um, there's Missing Link Lake, and then we paddled right along here, and we took this hefty boy, that was rough, he almost died, thicky, uh, thick boy, <laughs> Here's a thick one. and then we paddled along Tuscarora, considered camping, but decided we were feeling pretty fresh, and so because then, because we're professionals, uh -huh, portaged into Owl Lake, skipped across that, Portaged into Crooked Lake, looked at some campsites, but decided they really were not worth our while, and then made it into Gillis and snagged this here lovely five star. Well, well, we'll give it a four, maybe four and a half star campsite. Four point three six. Yeah. <clears throat> Agreed. Um, then we paddled up here into French Lake, right? Uh, yep. 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 And then took another longer portage into Peter Lake. Uh, Peter Lake was lovely. We had a nice breeze at our back, so we actually we managed to sail this one. <laughs> so we sailed across Peter Lake right. with a tarp. Uh huh. Found some sweet cliff diving and a moose antler there. It was there. There. Excuse me. Thank you, Ellie. And then um, took one last portage and ended up in this big boy, Gaba Michigami, maybe. Could be pronounced differently. Um, hunted for a campsite, and we now find ourselves here. Yay! Woohoo! What do you think, Orienteer Master Sensei? There you go. No, no, no. They're doing the cribbage action. Gavin and I. Jambalaya with some summer sausage in there. It's starting to look pretty good. Yep. Same campsite. It's the same campsite. We're back. <laughs> We're back. At least we got a campsite though. We That's campsite. right.
Looks like rain. I don't think we're gonna get hit. Oh, lightning. I hope that I caught it. Now we can just cool off a bit and chill. Honestly, sometimes it's easier to like go to sleep when it's raining, I think. Come here, Bob. All right, let's go. Wait, where are the paddles? Are they under? Oh, yeah, they're over here. All right, this is the last morning. The bugs are really bad. People are wearing hair nets. Head, head nets. And yeah, I'm GoProing. And we're gonna make it home today. Pretty beautiful day. That was probably one of the buggier ones we've done. Yeah. But thumbs up. Bye to the boundary waters. Bye, boundary waters. Goodbye. Back to civilization. Wow, this is a fun one. You picked a good one. This is like a mountain bike skinny. All these portages are so interesting. Oh, you okay? Oh, okay. Paddles are these? Oh, they're coming back. And another one gone. And another one. All right, you want to walk into the water? Yeah, but I can't put it in the water. All right, yeah, I can help you on that. Very good. All right, ready? Yeah. Which? Uh, okay. That's. I got it. And then we gotta go. Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Got a lot of water Say hi to the camera. Nice job. Oh, it hurt. Made it back. Round lake. Flies everywhere. We're gonna back jump in. Where it all began. Back where it all began. Um, let's see, where's Domino? Still at the car. Bomber. Yeah. Coming down the stairs. Get a shot. Ah. Like There's down. Domino. <laughs> we made it. Swim with the bug net. I was just thinking, I think I need to put the bug oh, net on. A uh yeah. Austin sprained his ankle. But he's a Super champ, he's still down. walking, so. Yay, nice job everyone.